Shuba, shuba, shuba day, shuba, 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 shuba day, shuba, 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 shuba day, yeah, 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 yeah. Now, no real man can live without a woman, like night to day, set a woman to her man. I am here vibing with one of the conscious warriors in Jamaica's entertainment space. His parents named him Mark Anthony Dyer, but we know him as Warrior King. Right. Junior Bunty. Yeah, man. Junior Kid. Bunty Junior. Junior King. So much thing, man. Powers. Bless the love. Heart of love, man. Bless the love, my life. It's a joy, man. That's the fire, I Heart of love, man. Greetings, man. Yeah. All is well, sir? Yeah, man. Everything is good. I'm alive and well. Blessings, man. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Never going to run congregation. Why? Why, 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 why? Teach them a burn pagan so. I'll never go where the pagans go. Never do what the eaters do, cause Rastafari give it the guidance. Teach them! Always make sure the message I reach them! Talk to us, though, singer. Yeah. Normally, oh, DJ. Yeah, from DJ. Early life. Place yeah, of DJ, birth. Man. Well, place of birth, Kingston, Jamaica. Kingston? Yeah, we're born at Kingston Jubilee Hospital. Okay. But I think about the age of four or five. I was singing it in a Clarinan. Sang good. We know Clarinan, yeah. we know Sangon it, man, because one place I'm gonna name Bad Rock and look at Kenshaw and Yeah, man, yeah, yeah, man, yeah, man, yeah, From yeah. Field, Shepperton, <laughs> the whole place. So. Born at Kingston, about the age of four. When my father from Clarinan, so. Oh, okay. Yeah, through so, the 1980 election was terrible. Oh. So, you know, go back to the hills, to the countryside, you know what I mean? Yeah, man. So, we're gonna sing in it, that's a district in Clarinan. Clarinan. Yeah, yeah, that's man. above. It's, it's below but, Spalling and, and above, above Frankfield. Frank All right, you know, Badrock, they're right in between. Yeah, man, you know what I think about Yeah, yeah so, so before you went to Sanguinetti, Zane, we are in Kingston. Did you spend your early years? Well, I think I've been at town. I'm not 100% sure. I've never checked, asked about my parents. Yeah, man. But I think I saw when I've been at town. I used to go to Alpha Infant School. Oh, okay. Yeah, but normally I think so. I used to go to school. Like yeah. My mom tell me, you know. Okay. But I really have much memory mm -hmm. for that, you know. But I think. You know, and you say you would have to ask the parents. Both parents are still alive? Still alive, Mister. It's a blessing. Yeah, man. Bless the love. Bless the love. I'm not doing it myself. Mr. Yeah. Dyer, we got myself. How many brothers and sisters? Well, I have three brothers. And one sister. And, and all of them are still around. Too. Everyone of them is still alive. I'm the only one there in Jamaica. Okay, cool, yeah, yeah. man. Cool. So you say you went now, Alpha Infant. Mm -hmm. Where else you attended school? Well, I got um, Sanginetti Primary School. Then I come to Waterford Primary School. Oh, okay. Then I got Independent City Allied School. Then I got St. Anthony Technical High School. Oh. Then we got Kingston Technical High School, then we got Fort Moore Community College, then we got National Tool and Engineering Institute. So I mean, all my life right up to music middle school. Yes. Oh, the best school, man. Yeah, you know, education was <laughs> it's my parents, especially my mom, my father too, you know, but yeah. through my grow with my, my mother mostly, because that's how we come father, Port Moore. Oh, okay. Because my mother and father separated. Oh, okay. Yeah, and so we come at St. Catherine Waterford and Port Moore come live. So how oh, old were you when you moved to Port Moore, to Waterford? Nine ten. Nine ten. Yeah. So you then spent about five, six years uh, a climbing down. Yes. What was it like though growing up in Sanguinetti back then before you San come to the side? Sanguinetti a total different thing. One we can show one big difference. With that Sanguinetti, you know, pass a body. I would say hello, good afternoon, good evening. You're at Kingston, Portmore, you pass a man, look at him too hard, you say, Where you know me from? Where you look at you know yeah, it's a right. different culture cause, but growing up in the country, nice river, family. You know, animals can grow animals, we grow chicken. Mm -hmm. You know, come a father, farmer, slash a businessman, you know, mother, nurse. Okay. You know, we have go, go each away at the time, three, away, three brothers of us that live at the time. You know, each away have a goat. You know, so it was really, it was really natural and nice and, you know, it's really mm -hmm. good. A good vibe, good, yeah, good, good. And then now, Waterford side, I know, what, what memory you have growing up, Waterford, Waterford side? Waterford, nice, same way. Nice, same way. Nice, same way. Good friends, but you know, more concrete jungle type of situation. Even though we used to go to Cayman as for some time. Oh, okay. Uh, you know, when yeah, we were them and the rest of them used to go over there, you know, Shrew Mark and Isaiah, all the way used to go over there, you know, go swim, Mickey Mark, all the works, you know. Mm. It was nice, you know, but you know, more rugged. Rugged. Yeah, because when we come to town, we can remember when we just start go primary school, when we open my mouth, everybody start laughing because I talk deep patois. <laughs> could they, could, you know? So when yeah. so we used to talk, and my mother said, I go to school now, bell food pants. So we used to ring me food pants. Like, Bingy ling ling, <laughs> bell so everybody used to laugh. I don't know if you know them type of vibe. They do a vibe, Yeah, man. man. So, you know? But I, I, that's part of growing up, a part of what my mom is today. Yeah, man. Just so growing up, Kingston first, Sanguinetti, then Waterford. Mm -hmm. At what age or stage you now do you start, you don't know, feel a musical vibration? I'm, all right. So from when I go to Waterford Primary School, I used to have a youth in a class in Raymond Brown. Okay. 
So he used to be like a DJ at the time. Okay. You know, he's not an artist now, but we used to beat the death scene by the time a DJ. So oh. we loved the musical vibe a long time, but I think I was about St. John the Technical High School, about 12, 13. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Really take on the persona and music and, you know, so we used to imitate Bunty Killer songs mostly. Junior Bunty. Yes, yeah, so I'm getting the name Bunty Junior. <laughs> so Bun Junior Bunty, the same yeah, thing. Man, yeah, man. yeah, Bunty Killer, the scene, I'm be like the Junior. So any song with Bunty Killer come out with, we go to school and, and replicate it and make me very popular. So school. early out, yes, you was a DJ. Hardcore DJ, man. If you want to clash it, I'll clash it. You ready? We ready, man. We have all the lyrics ready for that. Yeah, man. Yeah, them times we do music for fun and, you know, that's a, we never even take it like, like, you know? Like a, give a career, so what a vibe. yeah, what a vibe and a fun and thing, you know. Mm. Yeah, got turbulence, it's a school, same school, you know. You and turbulence attended same time. Yeah, starts loot and fire go school, loot and fire in a more bigger grade, but turbulence in the same era, same mm. time, you know. So it was like stats was coming like a whole community by itself, you know. You know, mega band and come from school, archive come from school, Sanchez come from stats, so and all of great all people. All of great people, yeah, man. All of great people, like the true one. True. But, so. Early out door, you were part of a, a door type vibration? Yes. With uh, uh, Licker Blocks? Licker Blocks, now called Persistence. Persistence. Mm. I gave him the name Persistence. Oh, you gave him the name yeah, Persistence. Yeah, yeah. So how that come about though? Like, it's just a natural thing around you just see each other and say, yo, we have to do something together, you know? We grew up in a Waterford. Me live on Maryland Road, him live on Carbert Way, on the pathway. So we grew up and play football, we grew up together. I'm a musician, artist, but he was the one who like, was a, like my first teacher. Okay. Yeah, because... When you come to write the bars and things, when you know rhythm start, you have bars, four bars, four eight bar, bars. Yeah, 16. Mm -hmm. Yeah, go on and on. So he used to teach me, say, when you come to read, you just start singing, you have to count the bars and know your timing. So he was the one who showed me that. And show, we start knocking and do music together. And we sing a song and we just start, people just said, said start called with Junior King and Licker Blocks. Oh, okay. And they changed from Bounty Junior to Junior King. To Junior King. So it was Bounty Junior, then Junior Kid. Junior Kid, and right. And I've heard right, Steady Ranks now. So you're not a rank rank east. Yes, yeah, steady rank, so you're not a kid anymore, you're a king because the growth and development and the talent and the type of songs, them time there, we cite Rastafari. Oh, so you started moving away from the hardcore type of vibe? Yeah, eye. yes, and we say Rastafari because we're mindful that certain words that come out of our mouth and certain things we have put to the public, you know, we know, we know, we know power, life and death is in the power of the tongue, tongue true, we know the true, power of words, so within them time you now, steady ranks meet me and change from a king Kid, kid, kid to, to king. Junior king. Yeah, so when you link with Licker Blocks now, which is persistence right. now, we start collaborate and it was Licker Blocks, Junior King. Okay. King, you know? Yeah. Yes, we soon pick up the rest of the name. You guys are now, you know, trying some of the, the concerts and he, you guys entered Tasties a few times. We had Tasties, but at the audition, but we never passed the audition. How many stage. times you actually tried to Tasties? I think once or twice, and I'm not sure. But I'm sure, I think we know we tried it. Mm. About once we tried it, but we never passed the, the audition, audition stage. stage. Yeah, but you know, it's a good thing. So when you even attempt to achieve something, sometimes no matter what the outcome may be, keep on pushing. Mm. You know? So not, not getting through the tasters was never something kind of, you know, this, make you feel disheartened. Every time when you, when, you, when you approach something, if you accomplish a goal or a mission, if you don't accomplish it the way you expect it to happen, mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's always kind of disappointing. But that means that we can't brush yourself off and try again, you know? Awesome. Yes, awesome. definitely. Yes. Talk to me now about the sound system education part of the journey, though. Yeah, sound system starting at Waterford. Waterford. You know, electric force, soul signal, Gravity and all the surrounding sounds I mean, in a Portmore, because Portmore is all full of sound. Mm -hmm. so, so for own with ta for, 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 for own talent. Yeah, mm. we'd have to um, go up on different sound system and any rhythm I'm sure. Because I remember you using no name, you know. So if they might play them have a time when just we go over gravi gravity cross and wish I used to live. Oh, okay. They just play some rhythm and once I read them I play, you have to fit on it and try to fit something on it. You know, cause even Vice Cartel, all of us going to the same community at Waterford. All of us used to sing on the same sound systems. So all of us grew up together like we come from the same school. You know, all of us, but you know, me keep the conscious you know, vibration part. and mm, do his thing, you know. But yeah, all, of, all of we are practicing at one of the talent. Yeah, definitely. The same. Um, we've got cactus, enough talent, talent um, competition we used to enter. Most time we never win, but at the same time, it was always a stepping stone and it, it built confidence and, and exposure. Mm. People start to see with the talent. Yes, yeah, so it was a, it always good. Yes. Eventually, though, you went solo. Yes. At what point in the journey you made a decision? At your going now. My little blocks were bridging up to today. Oh, great, man. Awesome. Persistent. I'm going to say, Marlon Stewart, I'm going to say, I'm a first Stewart. teacher. Yes, yes. I make sure I said publicly, men my good bridging. But you already happened with Marlon Stewart now. I used to get up every morning, 5 o'clock. We run around, came on a spark. Till I start chopping me over this, I'm faster than the horses. 
Because I used to get up every morning because Junior really sing a song. When I grew up with him, Junior really sing a song. Say, if you want to eat, you have to fit. fit, fit so I say, mm. me want to eat, want a song, we can so raise it. Fit. So I start to get up every morning at 5 o'clock. So I <laughs> and Little Blacks now, you know, the truth is right, truth, you know? Right, right. Me and Little Blacks used to say, all right, tomorrow, 5 o'clock. You see, by the time I link Little Blacks, I just was a boom, 5 o'clock, dark, I'm alone, you know? Because nobody came on a track. I run on it sometimes, three, four, depends on the vibe. Run on it and run on it and, and I build up my thing and so we start with some studios and record. So most time we go to studios and record when him for deliver sometime they run out of bread. So, so 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 the engineers and so used to say, you're going, the song nice but you're going make, make. you have to wheel and come again and you know, so sometimes in may they take it the right way. Oh okay. Cause, you know, sometimes and everybody can take constructive mm -hmm. criticism. Mm -hmm. So you know that did kinda of happen and then one time we used to go mixing lab. So we used to go mixing lab. Them time Fresh Foot was my manager at the time. Fresh? Fresh Foot, Garfield fresh Watson. Foot. Okay, okay. Yes, yeah, so I used to carry him to the studio everywhere, you know? So we him carry him to Link Bulby. So at the time it was a duo, so I carry a little black with me. But sometimes a producer said, Cause I'm busy too, you know, because I'm a do bounty killer thing. I do the whole part artist, because he's a great producer, right, great right, engineer, right, you right. understand? So he said, Come back next week, we'll come back next week, nothing happened. I'll come back the following week and come back the following week and nothing happened. So some people, not everybody have the, um, what you call now, the t determination. For persist or persevere, so that they kind of yeah, yes. so that they kind of turn him off a little bit and okay. say, I go to plumbing with my grandfather and stuff. Oh, okay. That they kind of um, get this up so about me still have my vision and my aspirations because even though me I go to the studio them, I see Morgan Heritage, me I see Coco Tea, me I see all the different ads so I see on TV and I love right. and admire. So I say yes, me start knocking with them people. Well, you know, so I want to be like them in terms of I want to be a singer. Mm. So we used to see them record when we go to studio. Sometimes we don't go and nothing really happen in terms of no recording or certain things. Right, but right. you used to see them record, you see hear them converse. So you learn, you learn. from it's observation. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you have to learn and build myself, build yeah. myself so I can, you know, be well equipped when I go yeah. up on the back of the field. You made mention that you attended, I think, some school of tools, remind me? Entai, National Tool and Engineering Institute, National by Ashenai tool. Road. Okay, oh, you know it? Oh. It's yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah with, the, with the mechanical engineer. The mechanical engineer. Yeah, with the plant maintenance, yeah. Okay, and did you actually use your field of study to do any form of work before music? Well, one time, when, when um, let me see, when we left, I think, let me see, we worked one time by Muller and Zod, one um, engineer, engineer Palomar, so we used to be like the supervisor, like, like it's a work. You know, I play, so you sometimes you have to maintain the machines right, and things. Right. So, we never use it much, to be honest. We never use it much, because when, when we get the break, I go to school. Oh. So, I sang a play on the radio. Oh, you were going to the same yeah, school Yeah, I was there. going to school. So, even when I sang a play on the radio, I play on RFM and the different stations in Jamaica, I did on bus, I and I sang a play, and people said, I know this man, and know, know, I sit down and listen, everybody I talk. And, me, and them said, they know me, and I mean, I know them, you but know. them said, no, but I listen to full jam, I say, oh, they relate to the music. So, you know, yeah. yeah. You now did some early recordings that never really take root. I think yeah. the first song you recorded was a song with you on Little Blocks. Yeah. We love to see the girl everywhere. Love to see the girl everywhere we go. A blessing from Charlie, Little Blocks don't know. Yeah, man. A nice, nice song. Who, who you recorded I think that song? It's a bridging by the name of Mali, I'm surname, and I don't know if you're related to the Mali's. Okay. But a Mali, I'm, I'm surname. Yeah. Yeah, we do it, but we never seen it. Was it officially released? I'm not even sure up to know, yeah, you know? Not sure. No, not sure. But that I, think, I think, yeah, because Persistence himself, they showed me a record. I think okay. they showed me a record. And then so they actually come from Wax, man? It actually... Yeah, we come from Wax and we record for Jazzwad. For Jazzwad? Yeah, because he was one of the first. Because them time he used to run Frisco Kid. Oh, okay. Frisco Kid, he was named Warrior. Yeah. So, so Frisco moved mm -hmm. the name from Junior, Junior King to Warrior. To Warrior King. He started from Warrior, out of those Warrior. And then he just took, everybody just took on to it and it's called Warrior King. And through Jah Divine Grace and Jah Divine Destiny, it manifested. Mm. Yes, yeah, so I saw it happen. And being around Frisco Kid now, we recorded for Jazzwad, which enough respect to Jazzwad because even though Frisco Kid carry me, Jazzwad could say, him not record. Yeah, because I just want certain people from read him. So I mean, him, that's why even today we have a very good relationship with Jazzwad because we always remember them kindness and good. <laughs> and big up to Frisco Kid, ancient monarchy, because yeah, he contributed enough. He carry me around enough and show me enough things. First man, we carry me on some fest. Oh, yes. Frisco? I mean, he introduced the plate for him one time, so we learned the craft that through him. So, and I learned a lot from being around him and listening to him too. Yeah. Nice man. Yeah, I man. never know. I never know so the link with Frisco was so. Cause Fresh Shoot, my first manager. Fresh Shoot and him was good, Virgin. Oh, okay. So because Fresh Shoot now, 
used to carry on fish so because at the time fresh to me say, he me know say arts are normal people, mm. normal human beings. So he wanted me to go on fish so kid, he wanted me to go on different artists. He so, said, people like me, we were just that God given talent. And I see me have the same thing. So it will, I like give him more confidence. You understand me I say? Man, it make a lot of sense, man. Mm -hmm. I think also you and Little Blacks recorded a song for Coco Tea. Coco Tea, but that's one of the things. When we go Coco Tea, we run around the track every morning. Oh, okay. So the man then, because Coco Tea have asked our track. So like the groom, the Marcel used to do over there, they used to trouble me and say, I'm faster than the artists them. I said, Coco Tea, you have a little youth, you know. I'm faster than the artists them, you know. But you know what, he can sing. Okay. So Coco Tea sent call me after I'm done, do my, my laps them. I'm going to go over to him and I'm say, sing something. I'm going to start singing. Give me something different because I want to see how versatile right, it is. Right, so as right. he says, sing with us, I sing and say, you're good, you're ready. Man, I'm telling you, come check him. Let me tell me alone around you now. Oh, okay. But I'm still, when I go home, I call Licka Blacks. But when we go to the engineer, when we go to the studio, the problem, the engineer say, because I'm breathing and I'm technical. You know, breathing. if you sing is that technique, you know, mm -hmm. if you can't breathe properly to affect your, your vocal ability, if you record properly, you understand? Mm -hmm. So, like, you know, that never really materialized. But afterwards, now, when we become Warrior King, like, I saw established record by Coco T with a song called Baby Girl, Why Do You Cry? Wipe Those Stairs From You. Yes, so Coco T produced a song there. Okay. Great, great Coco T. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> when you made the, the decision, though, or is this a natural flow that you're going to stop DJ and start sing? Want me to tell you the honest truth? Tell me. Honestly? Yeah. I'm going to two different scenarios. All right. We just find naturally, I start writing and you know, we listen more Bob Marley, we listen Dennis Brown, we listen more singers. You know, Garnet Silk have a big impact on me, Tenasa, you know, Admiral Tibet, and this goes on. So, me come like it, listening to them start impact on my writing. Mm -hmm. And me just start, after a while, people start, well, go on, singer. Me start hear that. And then, even when we record the song Virtus Suman, we got, we got, nah, we got check Bobby. Even before, I think before Virtus Suman, we go in a Bobby Digital studio. Record, um, fresh with the interest with the Calibod. Okay. You know, through Goofy, through Goofy, Mr. G. Young, young blood right Yeah, I'm instrumental and everything too, because he me a lot of strength and support too. Goofy? Yeah, man, maximum respect to him, same way. Because I know better for sure. So I go around there, me, me time I try to me DJ, set myself a DJ. Okay. I'm going to go on the Kuya Kuya Rhythm, Kuya Kuya Kuya, and some other rhythm. And man, they say, put, they put on a one drop rhythm. I say, find some panda rhythm there. Who put on the rhythm? Calibod. Calibod. Put on the rhythm. Huh? Banana, 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 I am a bum. You know that uh, 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 Terry Linen? Yes, man. I'm a black woman, yes, I'm a meek and mild. I'm from the money, I'm a be a nice, nice studio. And I say, yo, I dare say you're there. I dare say you're there. You have too much melody in your voice. Yeah. You I understand? Try, and from that, them time, I started upon one job. Because honestly, even when I get the rhythm vertus so man, and fresh card to me, we never gravitated to it. Come on, go up on the bada bada. Oh, oh, you want to go on the hardcore rhythm? Yeah. Them. So when you hear Zion Gate, they never food, love it. I tell you, honest truth, <laughs> and we can't say it publicly. <laughs> when Fresh Food yeah. carried the rhythm come give me, we never dig it at the time. But he said to me, he said, I can never forget. He said, what? You know, you say what people say, if water come from the pipe, mm -hmm. watch your anchor, it might not come again. So, <laughs> you know, I mean, I used to love read. I read a yeah. lot of books. Yeah. So I think when I write the song, all of the inspiration through the Marcus Garvey teachings and his Majesty teachings, all of that come out in the song Virtus Suman. Yeah, so, so it started out. Yeah. So, so you asked about the singing transition. Right, right, right. I said it happened naturally. Yeah, one more thing before we pick up around 2001 though. I think you did recording or recordings, I'm not sure, from Morgan Heritage right. before Virtuous Suman. Yes. Talk to me they about that. They were the first talent in them. At the same time, when me and Persis is go studio and the back and forth, that's what I mentioned in them earlier. Mm -hmm. You understand? But um, with Morgan Heritage now, we got to them and they hear me sing and they like the vibes. Peter, my, my soul rest in peace. You know, my condolences. Yeah, yeah, man. Blessings to the Morgan family car. It's like my family too. Because I say, in the early stages, them always was always there, even now. And I go to school, them time I got National Tool and Engineer Institute. Right. So when we go to school and we got mixing lab after one evening. And I said, come back tomorrow. So I have to find a song quick for the rhythm because I said, I couldn't make the opportunity to miss me. So I come, I left school, I school. <laughs> you know, it's a better term as a teacher. Yeah, well. You know, I left school. You understand? Because I don't encourage them things. Yeah, education is important. You know, you don't encourage that, man. Yeah, but it's so, what it is, brother. Yes. Part and past. I'm going to know that front. So I have to make that sacrifice. My mother knows she'll kill me. <laughs> but I left school. I'm going to go to my teacher. I'm going to record the song. A song named Rasta Come Together the People. Okay. Yeah, man. I'm a travel after that when I start tour, I see the song 
in, in a stores and things. And so it was released before Virtuous Woman or, or after? I think it was released. I don't know if it was released. I didn't know when it was officially released. Okay. At the time, to be honest, because we just record and I wait. Yes, yes, I was yes. not the only young artist that record at the time. So we just wait. But when we start traveling home, we start sitting at the record shop. Mm, so we know so the real official. Yeah. But Virtuous Woman now. That was a song where officially when we know it released from the start of the song, from the recording to the harmony going on the song, we follow every stage of that song. But like the rest of the songs we know we record but we don't know. And just cut out. And cut out. But that song you know, Virtus Suman was there right through the different stages. The mixing. Why? Because you felt that this was going to be the song? No, because I just the whole vibration. Oh, okay, okay. The whole vibration that happened in terms of um we did around the producer, we are work with the producer, through connection with Garfield same way and they make them believe in me, they see something great in me. And so they, they may learn the business and with their own watch all the different arts and record and the rhythm at the time. Mm -hmm. So that's how it happened. That's why I made their own the project at the time. Yeah. And you say no, when you hear Zion Gate first. Yeah, I never you never you never, yeah. you never told John to it because no. I never say you made it there. Yeah. What in terms of medicine, in terms of consciousness. No man, but in terms of you wanted the harder core, the, the, the harder rhythms. Yeah. Yeah. Me, in my mind, I was a DJ. Still a DJ. Even though people call me a singer. Okay. Yes. Eventually now, you warmed up to the idea and start writing the song. Yeah, write it. I want to say I start listening to the rhythm. The song start coming. And, and by the time fresh link me, come go run in the morning. So what would I do? Would I run every morning and then link up with fresh and we all the conversation. Okay. We all the daily conversation, what we will do today, what we will move today, what we will do. So I'm telling me to get the rhythm. Remember, we get it on the iBias cassette. I cassette. Mm, we get it on the iBias cassette and <laughs> Give me the rhythm, I go over. Them time, my setup is in my bathroom. Oh, okay. And because when I sing in the bathroom through the echo and the sound, you so like it. I don't know if it does something. You get a good vibe. Yeah, I'm just stop. Them time, every song I'm right, pay and in my bathroom, all them songs are right. Mm -hmm. All them songs, virtual someone written right in my bathroom. And then I get my vibes, I'm lock up the thing and lock up the window, them and everything, so I get that echo sound like me in a, in a, a studio. Uh, yes. A voice in both. Yes, so that's how, you know, we get the song. And. That song, and I think though, somewhere in the reading it says that song was actually recorded one year before it was officially released. Yeah, yeah. True? And that song was recorded before Pagan too. Oh yeah? Yeah, even though Pagan come out after. Right. Pagan was recorded before. Before? Yeah, never go to Pagan's go. So, so can my favorite song that's recorded? Never go, never go. Yeah man, right. we also talk about that, see? So now, Virtuous Woman was, why it takes so long for come on road? I must say, it was a juggling, you know. So you know when a producer that juggling, he might have a list of artists. Yeah, because him. Lost and some old people are playing him. Junior Kelly. Junior Kelly. Ultimate Shines, Lucian and so. He might have been listening to him, he said he want to make a juggling. I think about 12 artists up on the rhythm. Mm -hmm. So you know, by the time we record everybody, do the harmony, add instrument, the mixing, is a, is a time, it takes a process. Right, you okay. Know? So that's why I think it came out the time. It, and to me, it just came out the right, right time. Right time, yeah, man. 2001. This year, March, I think March was released. And 2001, so you know, it's about 23 20, years. 20, 23 years, I don't know. I'm going strong, and everyone sing the song up to this day. A world song, man. A pandemonium. You know? <laughs> a world song, man. It's like some wine, you know, some wine where you put down and cure. Get better, better. Yeah, the man. Them, and them type of songs I do. Mm. And through my travel, I may get exposure to the world. Through even the song, through, it went big all over the world. You know? Right. Big, 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 big. So, because of the greatness of the song, it took me all over the world. So I get to realize oh, the love for reggae music. That's why I keep the part, regardless of where I go on. Mm -hmm. Even when I come to Jamaica and see my little different than what I see I go on in the world, the still men, wallet. Yeah, man. And because I'm a fit, I'm integrity too, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. That song, who, who was the first person you actually heard playing the song? Elise Kelly. Elise Kelly. Yeah, she was oh, the first. Elise. Yeah, man, the 6th of March. Never forget. 6th of March. 125 p.m. 2001. Yeah, man. 125 p.m. I remember everything, man. <laughs> the first, I mean, I said, How you did that? I walk, I walk in a waterfall, and then I hear like every time I play, I have on a headphone, you know, and I listen, she, she play it, you know, and they like the whole community I play it. One time, so I flick, I walk and I run around my yard and turn up my component set, <laughs> and I start flicking. Like, to me, the feeling there is unexplainable up to this day. We hear a song now playing on radio, and we go travel, you, you have my house and your vehicle pass up here songs with me, but that first feeling, the first cut is a deep, yeah, it's a different type of feeling. Man. Yes. That's it, yeah? yeah, man. <laughs> That song though, even before we talk about the, the, the successes, yes. that song kind of led to you now having to leave Waterford. I feel leave Waterford. What go on there, sir? Waterford, I go on to Waterford. I can't tell you exactly what go on. Because I don't know, when you get the break, I don't know, in Jamaica, when you're artist, they want to get the dancing to, you know. 
<laughs> Cause sometimes you see some simple command right now, you a gangster, right, right. become artist tomorrow, all of a sudden they become the Dan. Badness business. Yeah, but you know, if you may Rastafari, I mean never want to contribute to certain things I'm gonna stand for. Right. But we can remember like one day we were coming in our car, them time we were a rent a vehicle where I drive. Oh, okay. Coming every own a vehicle. Yeah man, you know the pre. The song just start play, but you know the you understand? Mm -hmm. The song just start play, but things don't really start materialize it. So we are driving a waterford. Me, fresh with and I youth named Commander driving the car, but I do an interview on RFM. I think oh, I'm, via the phone? Yeah, music buzz. But we are past oh, the money upon the, the corner. Are we are past the money upon the corner, a flat bush right there. So, so we are past, we have to wind up a window, turn the AC in my car. Get up on it. Get up on the ear. Oh, so, okay. we may pass the man, and the man may, may feel like it as a um, style. Because we are trying sign language, even though we can't do sign language, but we are trying sign language, and we are always say, we can't talk. So when we preach and I turn down go my gate, a portion of man walk come down. Oh. But six of them are so. You know, we know all of them good now. Some of them not even living. You know, but you know, them come down and start behave away and you know, I wish attention I create and after that happened now, we start getting a whip a card from my phone from different parts of Waterford, what we for do? I mean, I said, what is father? Oh, so man, I call Ma you and different your thing? It, all the Tibali, all, all kind of places. All kind of, I get phone call up kind of way. I said say to myself, say, me, work so hard for you to reach. And for create chaos now. You understand? Some of us leave the community. But early one morning, about four or five o'clock, with a scanner bag. That's the only thing we left Waterford with. And we got Lindsay, we got live a place named Charlie Mount. Cause, you know, it's like, I made this stay at Ford, really and truly. I have to maybe move a different way than how you see me today. You have to probably different it. Yeah, I have to move different and I have to maybe move a different way. Which, I'm a Rastafari, I don't really want to take up that right now. Me, you know, and at the same time, it's just a misunderstanding that. And all of the youths, um, we create the vibes. All of we grew up together, we play football. We know one of that from where little youths. So you man, you must see a boss and get hype. Some people have it that way. You know, people, <laughs> people are going to have them own Yeah, man, we understand, thing. man. You understand, man. but you see, Jan know everything. And who feels it knows it. You understand? Yeah, because. So, so threats were being issued just to you or to your family? Every, 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 Everybody. Angle. Yeah, I come, remember I come home even before I leave out of Waterford. I come here and my mother showed me put a big poster. The MVP they put out the album, I think Vertus Man with a white suit and I have my hand class. Yeah, and juke out my eye and juke out this and juke out my teeth and say, wait, wait, can't say it over the So that them I got deal with them do the picture? Yeah, oh. and they tell my mother too. They tell my mother, my mother tell me when I come home. Some say, you know, say, I know, you know sometimes Bob Marley sing a song, you know, he who runs away, live to see her. Fight another day. Yeah, His Majesty. People say His Majesty are coward, you know. Oh, because if they do run the video, in, in 1935, you know, mm, we're going with Italian. Italian. Yeah, man. Yeah, with Mussolini. But he may have set the example, and at the end of the day, everything, he go back. He go back up. Conquer. Yeah, five years after, May the 5th, 1941. If you, you know history, based on your teacher. You know, yeah, yeah, story, yeah, I mean, no, because he's a teacher and I'm on right too. Yeah, well, I you understand? That, man. Yeah, so I <coughs> try to show you say, that the same thing. I made have to make the decision to leave out. So you show out and go yeah, rest out and instead. Yeah, I live at instead. You were out in the street, running around, came on a spark, and put yourself together to get the break. And as soon as I get the break, nobody never really know it. Start, yeah, nobody, nobody start and, and watch this now. Every year, yeah. every year, ghost and culture is to keep a show. Right now, back here, I know the, right now I play, I know where I come yes, from, man. right? Like third world. And every year, we sacrifice and buy. So them time, me and Lickup, like, first since I work, and we could, could we have a grace stage one year? Couldn't up, touch the stage. Up to now, <laughs> the MC on the stage, I mean, that we next, we next. I know them time, we really nervous. I want to hear this. We miss my backyard. We could have stepped on my right, we should have all stop and, and, and see. You I understand? See. Yeah. Mm. I would never get panicked. So we even get the break of Waterford at the time, enough people never really know what me. Okay. And most time we used to go outside. Oh, you never get a chance to really show them what you made no, up out of yeah, in a Waterford. But outside we go different places through Avalon and them bridges, they used to carry different places. Right. Chubby from 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 Waterhouse used to carry different places and we sing and we get a good reaction, but we never get much opportunity to do it. Apart from when we sing on gravity mm -hmm. and electric force and sometimes soul signal. Yeah. See but most free, thing that happened for me in the early stage at school. School was like I just everything start. The popularity, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. Every school mm -hmm. go from starts to Kings and Technical to National Tool Engineer Institute. So now your first official recording that was released became in 2001, one of the biggest songs of the year. Biggest song of all Life time. Change. The biggest record song. Time magazine said one of the big then put it in, in um, comparison with Bob Marley One Love. But through my song you don't know, it's a political way because through I go into the world now. Mm -hmm. 
you know, you understand where I come from, the man and the woman situation, so you kind of touch, touch enough can. So it's rated internationally. Even President Obama. We're going to reach to all of that part. All right, that all, right. <laughs> all right. I'll be said that we said this is that the life would, have, would have change suddenly. Road doors start to open up, planes, planes start to lift off, yeah. all sorts of things. You, when was the first time you leave Jamaica? Where you actually went? Trinidad. Trinidad. Yes. You're Tr alone or you go with other people? At the time, I think I'm a Norris man. Oh, Norris man. I think a Norris man, Norris man never concert, you know? Oh, okay. So Trinidad was the first place I ventured to as an artist and it was real, get an overwhelming response, you know, because right now Trinidad are some of my biggest and fans place, up to date. Same, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And I think the follow up to that was a three weeks tour with the messenger. Luciano. In the Uni United States, mm -hmm. Luciano. Yes. How you end up around the messenger this now? Well, we get linked to Mr. Copeland Fabs. Oh, Copeland, oh, Copeland, Copeland was Lincoln. managing Lucia at the at time. At the time, yeah. And, and with Luciano now, you know, because they must have some conversation. And at the time, he was like the fresh artist on the scene. Right. So it was a great opportunity. So I'm give thanks to Mr. Fabs. I'm give thanks to my brother Luciano. For that opportunity. Every time you see me, tell him thanks. I'm that grateful. As you should, man. You know, I'm that As grateful. What was the experience like though, going on the road with, with the Kabbalah, man? Yo, the nice, rough, everything in our one. Because nice see, and rough. Yeah, in the rough part I was singing every night. We never used to that. I mean, I sing in a cold. First, my experience, you know, you know, with North America, we do different parts, we go Canada, we go different places. And But even though it was a long set, I would do about 30 minutes every night. But from where I come from, that was a... That you was were a, actually opening? Yes, I was okay, opening for Lucian. Okay, Mikey okay. General was on the, on the, on the road yeah. and the firehouse crew firehouse with crew. Dean Fraser. You know, it was, it was a great... I think that was a foundation built solid for me. Through that exposure, I got with Lucian. It, it, we got a good fan base. Kind of you know. prepare you for what was yeah, to come. Yes. We learned the discipline, we learned nothing. I you know when you talk about Lucian, enough reading a Bible, enough reason about Rastafari, enough reason... And, spirituality. Enough spirituality. Yeah, enough prayer. And it was a great vibe. So I think... It's, it was a great way to start me off, you know? Yeah, because that was really nice, trust me. We are, we are Luciano up on the road. You said that was a good experience, yeah, a good man. moment in time. No, good in learning preparation yes, for... Yes, what, what to come. Mm. Yeah, so the, I, I, I went my lot of doors. He gave me a, a lot of great advice. We learned enough from not just Luciano alone, and the talk right. about the, the musicians, you know, the fire school, Dean Fraser, and everyone, Mr. Favis included. Yeah, man. So now, in 2002, I think your first studio album, Virtuous Woman, yes. was released on VP, VP, VP Records. Who, who was involved in the production for, well, for the, the album? Main, the, main, the main producer. VP was really the executive producer. Oh, okay. You know, they were the executive producer because we, Calibod, we are writing the songs them. Calibod, you have Donovan Germain, Mr. G, Youngblood, right, young Bertha Freshier, Michael Johnson, they do um, Bertha, yeah, the Bertha Suman and a song, Africa Shall Be Free. Oh, okay. And the tribal war with them. Hey, 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 hey. You know, I look to what? Them songs are a big song. I'm, my first album was a major success. I'm going to say major. The it only was thing, the only on thing, the Billboard chart for quite a while. I said the only thing, we never get a Grammy. I'm going to tell you, so choose my songs, them, kind of, you know, it go. Right. They speak some things, but intelligently, right. but people who intelligently know. You understand? Yeah, so, yeah, so. We said Donovan German. I said, Mr. Donovan German. You have Goofy, you have Chabano for a song called Jazz Alley, but Calibur Chelanser was the main producer of that album. Wow. I'm a blessing, man. Blessed, when your people attack us, you know. And as, as you mentioned just now, the album was a major success. Yeah, man, major a success. A lot of big tune up on the album. Internationally. You've included your favorite song, Never Go to Pagans Go. But Jai is always there. Yeah, Jai is always Rough there. Rough Road. Africa Shall Be Free. Jaggy by the Post of Chance. Empress of the Van. Big tune. Yeah, man. Big tune. Jamal did a collaboration with <laughs> on the album, um, a rendition of Marvin Gaye's song, Mother Mother. So, yeah. So, was it some nice songs. Real yeah. reggae music. So, are you saying now, Pagans, never go where the Pagans go, was written, was, was recorded before Virtuous Man. Yeah, and that was a letter to my mother, never go to Pagans go. Talk um, to me about yeah, that. Yeah, because at the time, you know, <laughs> you know, you're growing up and, you know, mother appearance, you come live with my mother, so she now understand the Rastafari fate, the Rastafari way of life, so she, we have to come out of the house and, so oh. me, when I write the song, I write a letter, but we just convert it into a song, I never go astray from my roots and my culture, you know? Neither will I. Go, I understand, so it's like, me, I tell her what me all about. But we just make it into a song and put out, because you know, other people can relate to it, because the Bible says, if your mother and father forsake you. But, and, but today, Mama doing, I'm a biggest fan. 
I'm a biggest fan and I love her so much. I love both my parents. Yeah. But you know, Mama. The ma mama, we yeah. see, see you free, man. We are come back around to that. But virtuous woman, you know, the people who then crucify me if I'm not asked if I give a couple of lies out of your side. Shuba, 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 day. Shuba, 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 day. Shuba, 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 day. Yeah, 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 yeah. Now, no real man can live without a woman. Like night today, he said a woman to her man. She's essential to his purpose and his mission. A good man is a glory to her man. She never take the power, she lets make him a better man. Every great man has a virtuous woman. Woman is say you love me. You never leave me lonely. Yeah. Always be there for me. Sanina worry. Yeah. Woman to keep it. Strong. With this part of your plan. Leave my mom and dad, find a woman and be one. Who don't wanna make my bond perfect combination? I am a black man. So I love my black woman. Alright, I did something there. I did something there. Big choice. Yeah, man. Brilliant song, man. Yeah, man. Brilliant song. I praise and the reality, you know, in, yeah. in order for any man really and truly make it well in life, you need a support there. Yeah, my wife, my wife and my manager. My wife and manager. So you know the balance, I'm well yeah. balanced. I you made mention earlier that wifey she is from Trinidad. Trinidad. Yeah, man. The first, first place I should bought. Yeah, I just destiny. Mystic is the vibration. Man. In, a, upon, in a sky with me, too, you know. You know yeah. On a plane. Mystical yeah, man. Yeah, man. It's like a sealer. Sealer, man. Yeah, man. Trust me. Yeah. Completed. So while virtuous woman, a big song, real song. As me, I said, now for me, the song in the catalog will resonate. Empress Divide, beautiful song, too, you know. Yeah, I get man. Wrong, see? But never go where the pagans go. That song. It's a special song to me. Yeah, why? Me. Why is that special song? It's just the words of the song, the meditation of the song, the rhythm, everything come together just for um, a perfect piece of production, brother. Yeah, man, yeah, a big song. Big, song. big song. And you said that song now was a letter to your mother. Yeah, a letter which you never get personally, but we put in the song. Yeah, put that song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Write it, have in a book and everything there. But we'll get another song. She get another song. And I mean, there are people who try to fight Rasta. I mean, we don't understand what Rasta man is all about. We try to put in a simple way in a song so even the little child can comprehend it. You know? What you're just doing now is even increase my appreciation for the song because whilst the message powerful, you know, you know saying that you wrote that song because of the situation with mommy made the yeah, song even yeah, more yeah, yeah. powerful at all, brother. We have become an artist and sometimes we just sleep on people's veranda. Even a waterfall, no people who know can know from how to stop them thing there. Because you now go out and she now let me in back. Let in. Yeah, but she never know the vision. She never know the women I see. But I'm going to tell you now, my mother have the best relationship and she's my biggest supporter. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because she, she realized over the period of time, she not hear me get involved in her now. Are you not asking a fool if she's no, not brother? Never, never yet, I never will. You know, as long as I live here, they never hear some derogatory come out of my mouth in terms of musically. Or anything that promote violence or anything that is. Loud you know, and crude. No, for me, no, for me not in line with, with His Majesty teachings and my faith, it never go out there from me, you know? Yeah, that's the main thing there. Real art and reggae music. Yeah, you know my favorite song, so never ask Yeah, thing. yeah, yeah, yeah. Never going to the wrong congregation. Why? Why, you why, why, you why? Teach them a burn pagan so I'll never go where the pagans go. Never do what the eaters do, cause Rastafari give it the guidance. Never say what the dollars say. Emperor Rastafari, I see I ain't just an obey. Rasta words are pure substance. Never go where the pagans go. Never do what the eaters do, cause Rastafari give it the guidance. Never say what the wicked heart say. Neither will I walk in the council no day. Hey, teach them to be no God, so Mythology and illusion will be always burning Corruption and confusion will be thrown in the ash bin Careful, teach them with your false doctrine Your false teaching, oh what a sin thing Justice in a disguise, it's salvation that you're seeking From the throne of David, yeah, it's obvious that you're drifting You have no respect for the king of all kings Of his name, I'll be always exalting and so and <laughs> You can't stop the singing career <laughs> Alright, you see it? Yeah man, let's have a prayer World tune, man. Yeah, man. World tune, brother. And so, uh, we are talking about virtuous woman again, and all the album itself. I would say some powerhouse songs up on that. The man meditation did. Same way, man. man. Hey, right now, and them time they look at my youth, teenager. Youth. Like, yeah, man, write them songs about youth. I don't to reach 20. Uh, yeah, trust me. So, how old were you when you get the break? Maybe 19, 19. 20. 19, I got 20. Young. But when we write, remember the songs were recorded. Right, before. right. Before. Yeah, I'm telling you, I go to school while we record them songs. You know, so yeah, so from me, from my youth, cause me always, most of my bridges them are elders. 
brother follow them and you know, show mark them and, and most, of, most of my brothers are my elders. Big man I could have been my father. Mm -hmm. So I always I couldn't bother with the, the trivial conversations them and my thing. It have to talk about Africa, you have to talk about upliftment of the black race and you know them things? Right. Upliftment of the human community upon the whole. And that's my mindset there. Jai is always there. Yeah. Rough road. See now we talk about Empress So Divine. Mm -hmm. Beautiful song. Yeah. Man. Beautiful song. Was that song there just a natural vibration or it was an empress? It's a natural vibration. Oh, okay. <laughs> I say natural, I say natural because I send out a message to the universe, the type of woman who me desire. You know? Yeah, the type of woman who me desire. You know? And that song, you know, God is listening to a song about, Earth of the Vine, so... I listen to them song there over and over and over. So I think so, that kind of have an impact. Kind of soak into the yeah, consciousness. Yeah. I'm going to talk for consciousness that one. Well. It might sound crazy, but sometimes I feel like God is still spirit in, in a me sometimes, you know? Mm. I never met him before, but that's a vibe. And this is about spirit in you. Dennis Brown is your cousin, true or false? Yes, yeah, true. True mother side of the family. So the music I come from there, you know? Yeah, man. The lineage there. Yeah. We come from a family of healers. So my, that's what I mean. They have to sing them type of music I'm sing. Positive, uplifting, yeah, encouraging, man. motivating, man. Empress so divine. There are a couple of lines. <laughs> Black woman, you're so meek and mild. Wanted to have my child, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me say, Empress so divine, ever looking fine. Woman, you should know you make my love light shine. You're ever looking sweet, right as snakes in the sea. Want you by my side some days of the week. Black woman so divine, ever looking fine. Woman, you should know you make my love light shine. You're humble and so meek, right as snakes in the sea. Want you by my side some days of the week, Empress. You're always on my mind. Woman, Man, you should know you make my love light shine. Anytime I see us like wonders and sign. You are my other half, a man to woman combine. Oh, blessed princess, you are so genuine. Natural and beautiful like the roses of the vine. I tell where you eat and say you're not near, I'm no swine. A virtuous woman is so hard to find. And they sang the record before virtuous woman, but they came out. After? Yeah, so some music go. Yeah, they had some beautiful work from yeah, the beginning of long time, time man. Long time, long time. Because sometimes, you know, we do we need, we need the earth too. Right. So you plant a seed at the same time, and you maybe plant a seed today, and you plant one two days after, and the one you plant now start germinate and germinate start before, before. before. So that's how music stays sometimes, you know? Mm. It's like seeds that you plant and everything have a time and season. So true. But you mean Jadivine time and some yes. work. Beautiful body of work, man, the entire album. Solid, mm. quality yeah. body of work, man. Yeah, man, definitely. One of the better reggae albums in you know, the 2000s, man. Yes, definitely. Yeah, man. In Great music, 2003, you now you did a, a European tour with the great Abyssinians. Tell you, man. Talk to me about that. Uh. Spiritual, but hectic. I think we did about 35 shows. 35 shows? Yeah, you know, what was the duration? Seven, seven, six, seven weeks? Yeah, six, seven, seven weeks. weeks. So, you know, so most time, one day after a week. And when you sometimes the day after I drive from France to Germany, you drive all 24 hours, you drive five hours, ten hours, you drive some long hours, a couple of hours, you know? So that was like a that 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 that, 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 that tour helped me. Cause so it's when them, them they do them tour they know your voice go away. You have to get innovative, you have to get creative. For start dance and all kind of things. Some things I never know me could have done. You understand? So it made me more yeah, versatile. Yeah. Mm, but it was it was really, really, really spiritual because you know the Abyssinians them remember for them some come out of just band, yeah, 79. Man. So, so when we tour them on there and then the knowledge where them impart from me and the experience watching them every night and see the impact what them song have. Because you know, even though they're out long time, when you go to show them in Europe with them, enough youths come at the show. Come on, see them, no, we have dub paid session, man, them and them line long. Look now, and I be a youth will come with young sound. You understand? So we are touring with them. Big dub plate them there, you know? Yeah, touring with them. Make me keep the part of my pants. So I said, them man, they are 60 or 50 or whatever age I was at the time. You understand? Mm. Yeah, so I realized, as long as I'm missing good songs, I'm willing to do what I do. Yes. You can always up on the road and do what I love and do, do the father work to the best of my ability. So it was a great experience with them. Nice. And, and so your reggae music was really appreciated yeah. really appreciate out the road. When did you actually go on your first solo tour, though? First solo tour? I think in California I do a solo tour. I don't remember the year. Oh, okay. I think California I do my first. But after the Abyssinian. Yeah, tour. after the Abyssinian. Because when I do, sometimes you have to go out with people Naturally, more established. Not learn the thing, man. No, just learn alone the exposure. Mm, okay. Because you see, for example, when an artist that is respected in a certain region, 
carry you as an upcoming artist fan tour. He share you with their audience. So all them people that become your fans. So afterwards, you maybe you can go on your, you can go on your, if you, if, if you represent now. properly. You can go on your Yeah, own. and the same people come and sometimes even more. You know, because they might tell a friend and tell a yeah, friend. And, yeah, so like California, I think, I think California first, on the West Coast. On the West Coast, Portland, Oregon, all the different places, Seattle, but me alone go up on tour and I, I, I see, me alone, yes. me, me alone could have full places. All it. Yeah, man, all it. 90 minutes set, two hours set. Yeah? Yeah, and them set the way I sing. I mean, them thing they build away, you have to do it. Yeah, remember, one time, remember one time, one time I go to Las Vegas, and I think I do a 90 minute set, I'm for about 75 minutes, I mean, I come out, I'm in my mind. You're done? Yeah, I'm done, because we do all that stuff, we practice. <laughs> oh, I come down the step, the stage step, the woman come with a, I remember if a man, a woman come with a, a big knock on him, the contract printed oh, out, contract. and the party tell him 90 minutes, and I have to show me watching and, and, and say, yo, you have X amount of time left, you do 75, you have 50, 50 more minutes left. And I have to go up there and say, yo, sing about that song then, play some, <laughs> I have to just create something. And look now, it worked. Yeah, well. So them, you know, so I realize that you have to, you have to, um, you have to, you have to honor your contract, you have to contract, you have to be professional. So it, it's a good vibe. In 2005, the second studio album, All the Faith. Yeah, All the Faith. VP again. Yes. VP mm. Records. And between me, honestly, internationally, the album was bigger than the first. Bigger than Virtuous Yeah, man. but you see politics and the music too, in you know, Jamaica too, you know? Was it politics thing. or promotion though? Politics, or, yeah. both of them in a one. Both of them. Yeah, so I'm not going to deny the fact because I never management, proper management structure. I'm mm. not deny the fact, but there was also a thing called politics. politics. We are learning that, man. We you know, because I've seen several interviews and you're, you're, you're a learned. teacher, so you, you understand? So that was a factor. <laughs> never have a proper, proper management structure at the time, mm -hmm. but you should have sang them big, you know, said open up doors. Yeah, so that was a factor, too, to be honest. Songs that I can't get me down. Yeah, man. What do you think, right? At? Them situation. I, oh, them situation. Side, yeah, side, side, yeah, was, side. Yeah, so I learned from them. I learned through Bob Marley. When you go through a situation. Right, it make music, man. Best song them sometimes, you know. <laughs> the biggest song them. That's what I mean, like when I tell you about my mother, I'm right there. Yeah, man. The best song them come them the real when you we real with the music, it connects more to people. The thing is that people out there can it's relate relatable. to the same situation, yes, brother. It's relatable. Mm. Yeah. My life. My life, Michael Johnson. Another again. love song. Big song. Let a Bobby Digital. Bobby. Yeah, so it's an honor for work with him. I'm solace in peace again, but I come through the hands of great people. Yeah. You know, that's how I make me stand up today. The same title track, can't, um, All of It. Yes, All yeah. of them songs. All of them songs have come. Big and you said that album, a yeah, bigger me. album on road but, than Virtus. So Virtus Woman Pagan was a big, big song, big, big songs. All to me, we can't even compare the music. I'm a music, I'm coming like my children. Right. So I can't tell. So I love Isaiah, I love, I love Del Mar, I so I love all of them equally in a different ways because it depends on the mood and the right, vibes right, related right. to the songs. But it, 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 it was a big impact in the international market. Yeah. You know, the response I get from some of them songs I wrote, you're surprised. You'll be surprised. Oh, yeah? Yeah, man, you'll be surprised, man. No, Warrior Ro um, Roots Warriors record. Roots Warriors production, like that one. Your label? Yes. So the 2009 album, Love is in the Air. Yeah. Self production? Yeah, self production. Se we work uh, with other producers, and, uh, but they mostly come out on, on label, you know? Distributed, yeah, yeah, yeah. Who distributed it? At the time, I think a Taz record Tads. distributed. Yeah, mm. Love is in the Air. Yes. Yeah, I, would man. Do, I would do an album for Bulby. I don't know if you reach us yet still. No, when I reach one of that. All right. Yeah. I um, want to give you Love, Girlfriend, Loneliness, or some of the tracks. Yeah, yeah, on, yes. And that album. Yeah, love man. Is in it, the it was air. a love album, just love songs, you know? Okay. Yeah, man. Beautiful, beautiful song. I just bought I just a, a love, love side, you know? Some love songs. Like, Wanna Give You Love. Couple songs, you know, they depend on it, you know. It's a girlfriend and loneliness yes. and them tune there. Max where they contribute to girlfriend. Oh, so that is the song where you are Max the Pan. No, that different Max you recover um three blind mice. You yeah, know song about three right, blind, three blind, blind mice. Like a remix. Uh -huh. So I was on a remix, like oh, a collaboration. Okay. And recently do you a song again recently. So okay. Album so album you have more, than, more than one. Yeah, yeah. So Max I'm, Piece I'm, of work, yeah, I'm yeah, elder, I'm a general great. man. Romeo. Yeah man, them mm. man, I'm a teacher too, you know? Yeah. yeah. Good teacher that. Yeah, great teacher. Great teacher, man. Yeah. Man, it's like a legacy, man, I tell you. And, and as you mentioned earlier, Zane, all the faith had, had great international success. Songs you have had, other songs that have done well for you internationally. I Love You, I think that went number one in Japan. The biggest song I have in Japan. I Love You. The song I sing, I get the response, I come and sing that song. Yeah. That song, uh, we sing regular, we sing even dub play that song, just wedding. People that want to get married. And they want I just thought they want to sing it, because I had the name of the couple. Right, right. Yeah, I tell you. 
a big, big song. Everybody, it's like when, me, when the rhythm start playing, I start singing the first note. Everybody, me just okay, I let it go and make everybody sing. Baby Girl. Baby Girl. Girl number one in Ghana. Coco T. Coco number tea. one in the scene. Oh, yeah, one. that was the song you said it for. Yeah, yeah Coco T. Yeah, that Calvin. Yeah, so that song there was a big, big song. Big, big song. All over the world. You know, and people know it in Jamaica, but it was more popular outside. Over, overseas, yeah, yeah. yeah. In 2011, Tell me on my son, I think Tads. Bolby produced, but Tads was the distributor. Oh, Tads was the distributor. What's about me? Fat Eyes. Fat Eyes. Um, well, Fat Eyes and Bolby. Bolby, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah. Okay, cool, no, man. Yeah, so, so Tads was the distributor. Mm. Melody, 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 you know me, boy. Right, tell, me your, tell me on my sound. Yeah, I'm buying it and leave it. Remember it? My, no, it's a different song. Yeah. For the same album, we do a song. Through Bolby Orchestra, we do a collaboration. You know, Bolby, the producer song. For the same album. Yeah. Sing it, sing it, sing it. Tell me how I saw though. Melody, melody, melody in my voice. Tell me how I sound. Tell me how I sound. Yeah, me loud and clear. Tell me how I sound. Tell me how I sound. What a far and near. Tell me how I sound. Tell me how I sound. Melodies beyond compare. Tell me how I sound. Tell me how I sound. For you alone, me fear. Rastafari melodies so sweet and fine. But you cut me honey and lime. Come on, come on, listen me line by line. Where the acapella with the rhythm combine. Melody, melody, melody in our voice. Melody, melody makes the music nice. Melody, you know that song they come. Every time I write a song, I say, oh, it's sound, on oh, my sound. You know, so my yeah. friend always say, write a song name, tell me on oh, my sound. Let me ask you a question. Zane, mm -hmm. you see, in Jamaica, we're strange, you know, we're funny and we're fool. Do you get a vibe that people have confined Warrior King in Jamaica to virtue some man and never go where the pagans are? Sometimes, go? sometimes. But you show me, you know, the best. You see what people say about me or where they want to say, me, that doesn't really define me, because I know who I am. I'm a king. I'm from a royal dynasty, you know? But you see people who research and know music. Them Most know. of the thing bigger than Yeah, that. man, let me tell you, President Obama said, my favorite singer. We all get round to that. All right, enough thing you get round to. All right, don't worry yourself. But me tell you, say, let me, let me tell you, let me yeah. tell you, say, I sing 90 minutes set. You're supposed to know what time it is. I will live, I will live, I will live. And a two, you can't do two yeah, songs for 90 minutes. We know a catalog deep, man. We know a catalog deep, yeah? So we are talking about the album, you know? So we are said that was it. Watch this now, Tisha, watch this. Are you tell me, remember me write my songs, you know? Right. And you write all your songs? That me I try to tell you. We write my songs. So if a man can write, never go to the and go. And can't get me down. And vert to man. You feel like it done this, sir? Empress so divine. It, me say the list goes on. Tell me I'm a song. You understand? Yeah. Many songs. My life. But you see, maybe sometimes even my person and my personality. Me is not a person where, me is not an artist where I love the limelight and thing too, you know? Mm -hmm. Me is a humble guy, you know, say, he that uplifted himself shall be exalted. Mm -hmm. You know? And now, my wife, proper, proper management structure around me, you know? And so things solid right now. We have one band, Roots Warrior Band. Roots Warrior Band? Yeah. You yeah, asked so me to say they don't want to become a doctor? That was my first ambition because my mother was a nurse. She retired now. You know, she used to work at Waterfall um, Health Center. Center. Mm -hmm. As a matter of fact, she was the head of all the health centers in, in, in Portmore. Portmore. She used to work at St. Joseph, Bellevue Hospital, KPH. Everywhere. So we used to there everywhere with her sometimes. He's a you doctor know? now, man, but of a different yeah, kind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 like, you know, even medical and we learn about herbal aspect of things. Right, right, but, right. But yeah, I, do, I eal people in my car. I eal people in my car. words are spiritual food. Mm. So we eal people with the songs, them, you know? Yeah, the words man. that come out of my mouth. So tell me on my son, as we say, system is crazy. Hmm. Bulby. Jai is the only one Bulby. I can see that some of the songs on yeah, that yes, album. Yeah, yes, Bulby produces and Fat Eyes. Fat Eyes. My apologies. Mm. Fat Eyes. Because it's a collaboration, you know? Yeah, but Fat Eyes yeah, never. In 2016 now, the Roots Warrior, Mm -hmm. Album and yeah. that again was on your own yeah, label. Yes, me and um, Iris Sounds International we collaborated on yeah, that Iris. one. Yeah, I said that for two years in Iris. Yes. In giving up Rastafari, Protect, yeah. and some other yeah, songs. Yeah, we produced some songs. Our label, Iris Sounds. Iris Sounds. Yeah, so we had through at that time, to be honest, it's true. We knew to the production aspect of thing. We collaborated with people because mm -hmm. one. Yeah, learn the thing. Yeah, so sometimes, just like I tell you, say, when you're as an upcoming artist, you have to open for arts to establish, have a good reputation, so you can build so, so it go. So we have to start from somewhere. You have to become mm -hmm. a caterpillar and then you become a butterfly. butterfly. You understand? Mm -hmm. Yes. I know there's a there's a there's a later album called Universal. I, I, it, it's in the making. It's, Universal. Oh, like, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know no, release no, it. No, really it shall oh. release sometime. So, but every time I keep it I release that time, sometimes just do some things. So, so like. since um Roots the, the, the Roots Warrior, yeah. there, there hasn't been an album, an album. But a lot of singles. A lot of singles. But no album. Okay. So right now we, we get it there, the people can prepare for something big. Big. 
And you made mention earlier now that you have your own band. Own band, own production, own everything. Own band. Management, own we're independent artists. And I own sign to own label, which my wife are the owner of the label. Yeah, so we're independent. And we learn from the greats in the production. We learn from VP Records. We learn from a lot of people. So we understand the business. Still learning, but we have a good understanding. Yeah, you don't have nobody signed to the label though. We're working on it. Okay. Well, but I may, may use myself first. I don't say use the term. Get it. Get it. They don't use the word get it. But I really want to use that term there. You understand what I mean? But yeah. But we have we have we have artists like you know artists from even Trinidad and other artists we have interest in you know Jamaica and all over. Yes. No, we have referenced this a few times. So we got to talk about it now. In 2008, I think. 2008. Barack Obama told CNN and NBC that Virtuous Woman is one of his favorite songs and Warrior King is one of his most favorite regular artists. artists. Yeah, and that's a fact. You know? Even though we not sing song. A big promotion for the brother. Yeah, biggest promotion, big promotion. Because many artists in Jamaica, when me to, to me, can maybe can sing better than me. Many artists before, many artists are coming to my time, many artists are coming after. But he, he still recognize I and I. And it's not even him alone. You have a youth name, Lewis Family. Lewis, Lewis Family. Family. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, I'm saying too. So I'm saying the, this. Are the, are the, two, are the two same artists make reference to Bob Marley and Warrior King. Mm -hmm. I don't know none of them. I never even sing for them yet. I sing a song about them. But I give thanks. The music is going high and low places. People are in a leadership position. I listen to the song. And I inspire, inspire them. So it's a good vibe. You yeah, know why that's important? Because Barack speaking to CNN and ABC, and millions of people he might talk to. Yes. Lewis Hamilton, I do interview on BBC. Millions of people he might talk to. I want to say yeah, so, so a millions of people who probably never familiar with the name, no, you hear the name yes. and probably have to look for his song. Because mm -hmm. Barack Alice is like a Louis Hamilton Alice is Sometimes I tell you, sometimes we go through immigration and we go through and then stop the book. Yeah, yeah but my artist, you know. <laughs> immigration artist, I say, oh, you know that. Yeah. <laughs> so, so that's the yeah, Rastafari, you know? Yeah, yeah. So it, it, it has, it yeah, has done know. its thing for you? Yeah, man. It's a joy, man. You see, it's power, enough, good enough, music. So sometimes when we realize, a lot of the grass people love my grass people love mm -hmm. my song, but you see a lot of people maybe in a cinema stage show too. They might listen to the music. Yeah, they might listen to the music. They might listen to the music and that's good, car. And as I, say, as I say, listen to music, the music can be found on all the digital places. All the digital platforms, everyone, everywhere. Everywhere you can buy music nowadays, yes. you can find Warwick music there. You never run up in an issue with publishing a royalty before you take it. Run up in a thing, man, of course. Run up in a night. Run up in a night, man. Come and listen to interviews, run up in a night, liquor. But not so bad <laughs> now. Not so bad. Yeah, because. Not you know, so bad, no bad. Yeah, not so bad, no bad. <laughs> but we run up in a night and we still have some issues that we have to we're resolve. Have to fix up. Yeah, but they don't know, it's a learning. But what me try to know is to the youth that come after me. Every time I get the opportunity yeah, to talk to them, them. I mean, just I teach, teach them. them. You understand? We have to teach them. Coming on the phone at the same trap. You know, but and at the same important. we give thanks to people, my big, my big brother, that's the only of South Carolina. He may register with a lot of the institutions, so even before we get the break, like the Sound Exchange and the PPL. Not even me didn't know. Some, yeah, no. man, brother, do you really yeah, man, right, some, well. some give thanks to them things, some encourage all you to make sure, you know, don't sell out your publishing, you know, keep secure your publishing, you know, all the upcoming artists, don't sell out your publishing. You understand, no matter how much money they might give you, because you're publishing your, your pension, your pension. You understand, yeah. your publishing can work million. One, one, uh, you get song going on a movie or something. Ask somebody to take a song and yes. sample Somebody sample your song and you know, get a dollar from it. So don't do that, you know. Yeah. I encourage all artists, upcoming artists, this is the advice to you know. No fun, no one get the break, and sometimes rough. But in at the same time, you try to get the break, try to learn the music business, the business of music, any way you want to put it. You know, try to learn it and educate yourself. You know, so when we are come, a lot of people we are record for, and them they never take the time out. To educate. Yeah, we learn, but you, me have a quick head, me not so, me not so bad, cause I get a good education. Yeah, why? Me never tell no lie. You give thanks to my mother, my father, my parents. You understand, especially my mom. We get a very good education. If you know, if you check my history, most school me attend, I was a prefect. Anybody know me now, so me, me. Nerd out, man. Yeah, I'm a nerd, man. But I'd say, I have the rude boy. Look, yeah, the streets, man. The see yeah, but my brother. That's important. Yeah, go on. What encourage that now? My mother don't play. Oh, my mother did So you go to that school and they're on the Ray Ray and thing and go on my thing. See, my mother now. My mother come to school and I have the report, and I'm good. I have here, no bad thing about me too tough. She beat me in front of my friend. Oh, and I, at school then? And I start at school. <laughs> so I couldn't you afford that. So I make sure I say, yo, I beat the book, I ramp with it. And, and see today, I give time. Why you think I can write my songs? You have some artists that can't read and write. Mm. Me, me see that. We can't sign an autograph, we can't read any book. Any word me know, I can't flick up in a dictionary and find the meaning. I, I know for, you understand? Yeah. You can write. 
context. Well, yeah, well, you said a book smart and a street smart. Me balance. So if you can't put it two of them together, I'm balanced. Them dead, brother. I'm balanced. I'm balanced. They can't hold it for yeah. you to do that, man. I'm at school. 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 I'm you know, being an artist, all the good, the bad, and ugly. All the people cover on. Yeah, but I still have the education, so I know, mm. still know myself. Because the foundation was set through my parents. And then, as a Rastafari, yeah, we know man. his imperial majesty and what he stood for and stand for. No, I'm mm. in a detour from my part, no time at all. Yes. You are Jamaica's, well, you are an, an ambassador, I think, the Jamaican ambassador for Team Seas. Yes. Which is a environmental, global environmental initiative. Yes, How you get part, involved in that? All right. A youth named Joey Clay. They contact. Okay, okay. I'm a virgin because he's doing enough work, he's a photographer, a videographer, okay, okay. you know. Um, he link us to so some people from TNC, I tell you what they are in Australia with these people and they want to come to Jamaica where they look for somebody in the music. Oh, okay. They gave me representative, represent them, them brand. So, so he gave them a list of names. So when they do, when they do their research, they give a list of names. I wasn't the only name, you know. And because my, what me represent, what me stand for, it resonated with their brand. So they contacted my manager, Leslie Ann. Mm. And from there, so we team up and go up to Kingston Harbour, meet some beautiful people, do some great works where they might like unsung heroes, you know? So that's how we link up with um, Team C's and we become the ambassador for them in Jamaica. Yeah, so when it comes to the environment, I might think that. Yeah, man. Keeping the rivers. I might tell you, see the whole experience, it opened my eyes big time. Because if you go down to the, the harbors, them, down at town there, and you see the type of debris. You know, don't stay, man. Yo, in a normal, I mean, the encourage right now, the opportunity is good. I have done studies down there, because Miss... a geography me teach you, so I have, All right. you understand? Me, so me I I know what right now, I love to use the platform, Do it, appeal. Do man, I'm going to ask, man. Because I worldwide. <laughs> Do it, man. To, to Jamaican Massive and to the people them all over the world. You saw me having a garbage, up to what day I drive and, and a KFC box in on my face. I never had a glass. Boom. Yeah, man, people just, people, it's eye. like them don't know, and sometimes it's not knowing what they want to the environment. But you throw them things that going to the goal and go to the sea and people blame the government all the time. So always and always nasty, blame. Nasty, nah, nasty, not blame themselves. Me not like it. Come nasty, do better, man. man. People of the world, people of Jamaica, and do better with the environment, man. Don't garbage don't disposal out here. Man. And what me do? If me have garbage, me keep them in my vehicle until me reach home and secure them. As it should be. Yeah, me not throw things through window, me not throw plastic back and all can no. Mm. So you know, let us be. We are, we are we're supposed to, our first role and function as human beings to be protectors of the planet. Because you give it the, everything, the earth is the last and the fullness here. Yeah. Mm. So we have to protect this. Rastafari protect, you know? Yeah, man. Yeah, Rastafari protect, you know? <laughs> yeah, man. But we must protect me from the enemies. <laughs> but don't think about it, but I use the yeah, title yeah, yeah, of the song, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You started a foundation in 2018, the Warrior King, King Foundation. foundation. Yes. What type of work you do there, sir? Well, the foundation, because we're in Jamaica, in a Kingston group, and we say Waterford, and every stoplight you have youth. You have youth, where there is stoplight, and some little youth, I mean, I say, I always wonder how oh, they're not in a school. Yeah. You know? And when we go to different islands, I mean, I see that. Mm. So we try to create the foundation for try to help youths them, you know? Okay. Get a, get a better education. Who can help? You know, who can help everybody? everybody? So we try, and we try to give back to some of our schools and things, you know? Like, like some of the primary, we give back some keyboards and some things. Nice, just, man. just to keep the youth them active and things, you know? Yeah, but that is what the foundation is for, really. Because, you know, me strongly believe in education. Because even, no, even cool, His then. Majesty, Alistair said first, when he was emperor in 1930, crown emperor, 2nd of November, he held the post of minister of education for quite some time. So through that and through the, well, my mother and parents, you know, my father too, you know, pushed the education thing. We realized uh, it's very important. Very important. Yeah, and through you, them lack the education, that's why they get themselves caught up in uh, some things sometimes and proper guidance, you know. So that the foundation has to help youths off of the street who can help uh, better themselves and make them can help them family, you know. I mean, if you ever do anything with the foundation, I mean, the platform is always here. Yes. Just call my phone and we're willing to share what you are doing with it. This with year, the, we are going, we are, we are, we are, you know, so we are, we are trying to do this year now, we are trying to reach out to some international, for some international assistance. Okay. But people see what we really do is genuine and if they can help in any way possible, you yes. know, like you can give you books. Sometimes you can't even find a bag to right, go back to right, school, right. Which is uh, true, shoes which is or true. something, if they can help. Trust me, brother, I know it, go on. That, that, I have that, seen that, it for that, years. Work, years the Warwick Foundation, I assist in those yeah. regards. And as we there, sir, so, for the people who want to reach out for the foundation part of the thing, but also promoters and sound men who are out dub plate, all them reach you. You can go to warriorkingmusic.com, you know. All the Instagram and all the social media handles. Warriorkingmusic.com. Bookings, management, dub plate, anything you want, contact me about. Or, you know, you want to right. be a part of the journey, same way. 
warriorkingmusic.com show you the Instagram angle, which is warriorking9, the Twitter, warriorking9, show you the TikTok, all the different, the Facebook, everything that's out there. You know, we, we try to be active on all platforms, same way, you know? Nice. You were a, rep a Jamaican representative at the 2014 Boomtown Music Festival, yes. UK. Yes. I think you, Jimmy ladies Cliff, and Jimmy, Jimmy Cliff. Yeah, big, you know. How, what, how you end up there, so like, was it a, a, a situation where management deal with it or a reach and reach out to people, us? People reach, reach, out. reach out to me. So you, the great at the time. Jimmy Cliff, Jimmy Cliff, the great Marian Al. Yeah, man. So we represented the Jamaican culture and the Jamaican music at that festival. So it was great. Boomtown Music England, Festival, London. UK, yeah, man. 2014. A lot of people, big people, and, and I represented very well too. Mm. Yeah, man. We can't imagine, I man. Yeah, we don't we know that. Let's not do that, yeah, man. We represented very <laughs> well. Jimmy <laughs> Cliff, Lady Star, all of us represented very well. Trust me. In our, our own way. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. But Jimmy Cliff was one of the surprises upon our shoulder because we the backstage, you look tired, you know. <laughs> when I see the man fancy, man, I flicked over everything, I couldn't believe me. I said, my God, man, music, it here feel not paid. No paid, man. Yeah, man. Because, you know, he's a big man, you know. Big man. When you go past stage, he's like, like he's me. Young boy. He just like me, you know. When we go past stage, like, we transform, he's like, a different Irish come zone. over. Yeah, man. Mm. And I see today, man, I watch him car. And I realize uh, me and him share a similar birth sign because I'm born July 31st. And I'm born July 27th. So we are lion, we are Leo. Mm. So I realize that some mistake too. Yeah, when we go past the stage, it's like a different vibration just take over. Yeah. And just, you know, use I and I. Yeah, you have made mention of collaborations with Barrington Levy, yeah, Barry Jamali, Barry Saman, Richie Spice. Richie Spice. Max Romeo, Max Romeo, Linval Thompson, Linval Thompson, enough, DYCR, enough great, enough great. the center, enough turbulence. Great. Yes, enough great, enough mm. great, enough great, enough great. And I ask that, when well, I said that, we said this, is there anybody we in the work with it collaboratively? We all don't mind going to the studio, go mash up and read it. Lauren, Lauren Hill. Lauren Hill. Yeah. You know, we are even around the price of something, right? you know? Something in our pipeline. Yeah, my, 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 my mentor, that man. Come on, I'm going to ask about that. I'm going to ask about that. I'm going to ask about that. I'm going to So, everybody would know me. If I'm school days, no, that, that would be like a privilege yeah. or honor. So, it's in the pipeline. What was your favorite killer tune back in the days? No, some of you can't have a single fan of the thing right now. <laughs> but we can say, like, man. well, don't do not get me. Now, the vice again. Don't do not get to it. Nuff, nuff song. And the politician is the guns they may bring. Hey, just a crack. And the code, they must support the killing. They check it out. The whole of them, I say, my pocket is. Yeah, man. Yeah, man, so enough songs, enough of the rude boys. I used to use them in a clash in a school. You know, but up, I use them just for fun, you know? Yeah, that's but what I say, about. as things sometimes go by and yeah. we grow more mature and we understand that things get, get different, and, you know? Life and death in the power of the tongue. So that's why I'm very selective with the type of words that come out of my mouth. That words can important. create and words can destroy. Words sound and power, man. Yeah, man. You know, it's something good, brother, brother. Yeah. yeah. So, you and know, our brother, I see you're working on the anniversary. Yeah, anniversary life. Light. And any, any plan as, as it relates to when it will come out? Well, sometimes I don't even want to say it. You because don't want to say it. It's when everything finalized, then Just we can, so. yeah. Because every time I work on a project and like, we give out say it will come out next week or next month or within a time, it, something, you always do something. So I want to finish it properly mm -hmm. and then we can make the public know, you know? Nice. Yeah, man. But we have an Eternal song I'll drop first, too. Oh, okay. Myself and Eternal in a collaboration. Yeah. And oh, so that one of the songs after yeah, the man, album? Yeah, man, yeah, man. We do a shoot all the video already. Oh, yeah? Yes, I saw me I do my thing. I try to make sure. Because, you know, in this, I remember, you know, back in the day, no people know the songs, but sometimes they don't know how me look. Because I remember when me, remember Pig and I have a video, you know? No, no, video. True, that. But I was like the biggest yeah, song. Mm -hmm. But sometimes they will say Warrior King some places, and then, but when we go, like, yay! Yeah, yeah, you yeah, understand? Yeah, yeah. But me, I look say, up. Yeah, so <laughs> we're, 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 we're team still, and I say, yeah, go on. Every song we put out now, Visuals. After. At the age we live now. We live in the age so we have to work with it. Digital age, man. Yeah, man. So every song have a visual, so a visual will help enhance the song. True. You know, bring the message across even more stronger. So true, I, true. I, that's our mind there with everything. Yeah, man. Looking at the journey thus far, yeah? Yes. When you assess it, when you look at it, is there anything in particular that gives you a sense of pride, a sense of, you know, a gratitude when you think about it and say, yes, you know, I miss a diet do that something there. Or me did involve in that. Yeah. You see, when we go in the street, and when we go anywhere in the world, you see the respect of my command. Not just the music I'm sing, but because I'm a person, I'm an attitude, liberty. I'm a character, I'm a liberty. Mm -hmm. I think I feel good in myself. You know? Like, I feel good in myself. I feel good in myself when people can say, yo, you see that youth there, you see that rust there? I'm one of the few. When I say I'm the only, mm -hmm. I'm one of the few 
reggae entertainers or reggae artists or reggae singers, whatever term them on used to describe me, which we all understand. Right, right. They always say something positive. So them things are good. So more I know, so even when I'm there in the flesh, physical form, people can see say, the works. It was not just about me. And the works, you live it's on. It was higher being, you know? Mm -hmm. My work was a job work me I do. So people know. So the, them things that give me the most comfort. When we go to places, we go perform. Yes. You understand? And sing. How people respond to the music. When we in the street and people talk to me and relate to them. And some, we go to places and people cry. Yeah, we go to places and people, people cry. cry. Yeah, man. So, yeah. We see how, how powerful the music is. Musically speaking, though, yeah. is there anything? Or let me ask you, musically speaking, what you, you, you still have designed to so add to the legacy of Warrior King as as the journey go along? Honestly speaking, at this point, I don't even know. It's but when what, 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 yeah, and when we do, we just put the most in front of everything we do because no one know what tomorrow bring, you know. But when we can say, me continue to do good. And continue to shine light. Universal light. Universal light. Yeah, because light. Mm. today they are, me there with it today, and tomorrow you don't know what kind of opportunity a person might call. You know, suppose Lauren will come and say she want to have with me. You know, that, I, I, that woman. I call her cover. Eh? Call her power. Yeah, I meet her the other day, uh, the Bob Marley thing there. Yeah, I meet her the other day, a Joe Mercer thing. You know, I'm so rest in peace again. But, oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I okay. meet her, I tell her, say, she she's one of my favorite um, singers. Her music inspired me so much back in the day. So I tell you, say, me there today, you don't know what kind of... Just like when Obama said, Warrior King. Me, the day before, me never know that would have happened. So anything can happen. You know, when you do good things, anything can happen. So any opportunity, any doors can open. Right, my general? Yes. Yeah, so I just, that's what I did my mindset. Assessing the journey, you ever sit down and look upon it and say, yo, you know, you probably did something that you should, you wish you never do, or you never do something that you wish you, did, you should have done. Sitting down and looking. <laughs> yeah, man, you know, reflection. So, yo, Michelle. One thing I learned in life, and I give the advice to everyone who are tuning in, mm -hmm. even the eye, listen to this. Never make decisions. I mean, repeat, never make decisions. I don't regret nothing, I do still enough. Right. But I just show my journey, me, me, I give her advice. Well, yes, man. Never make decisions when you're too happy or when you're in an angry state of mind. Never. And when you listen to me, care, no matter when you're happy, Come and say, I'll get back to you. Yes. I remember to check myself first. And even when you know what you want to say. Yeah, man. Give it some time. Give it some time. Process and say, so you're kind of in an upset mood, don't make yeah. certain decisions either. You end up regret it. You know, so that we just say along the journey, but we don't regret nothing because everything is a lesson. We have things that they call mistake or right. experience. Wisdom. What is experience? Wisdom, man. No, lesson, but what, look, no, lesson, look at it now. Experience, the Bible says, experience is wisdom. We always right. hear them saying that. But what is experience? Sometimes the mistakes that you make in True. life give it experience. Bad experiences, which I'm true, you make bad decisions, it still teach a lesson. Militar, but when you're still man. alive and you overcome it still, you know, say, no, do that. I can maybe advise someone, say, don't do that. Yeah. But I'm going to repeat again, don't not make decisions when you're too excited or when you're in a kind of angry or upset mood. Make sure you level your circle. You understand? And then you make your decisions. Like somebody call, wisdom, somebody call and say, yo, I want it in Africa. For example, see, for example, I'm a place where I really want to go. I mean, I, you understand? You say, all right, okay, all right, you know? I don't know me really deal with them still. I'm going to try to show the example. Right. You know? You have to just calm, calm. do it, and you understand? Mm. I'll get back get to you. Get, together, get, get the basic information. Like, yeah. Even though you know, say you want to move to, Afri to Africa. Is it what I say? Yeah, man. Yeah, but I just saw. And as you say, Africa just now, is there a place when the phone ring? I hear yes, uh, opportunity to there for your show to give you a different energy. You just love going to that place there. I love going to Trinidad. Trinidad. I love going to Bahamas. I love, to me, I love going anywhere people there, you know. Because I'm a people person. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't know if you, you might not know me like that, but half the year, different from music, I love it type Vibration. of person. Yeah, so anyway, anyway, you know, I love yeah. anywhere go perform for people who want to see me. It's a good thing. Because I tell you, you have many artists, and when you choose to call Warrior King for your performance or make an appearance somewhere, it's an honorable feeling. So I always take my pride in doing everything I do. Mm. I always do my best, regardless of the situation and the circumstances. Yeah, I'm going to be your best. My best with the situation, man. Mm. Where are you going to work at where you hope? I promote a call if you don't have them time. I love to go to Ethiopia. I love to go to Brazil. You know? I do about a couple of parts, about 10 parts, but I'm more already, you know? So I go, I go every continent. Every continent. But I never I go to Africa, but I never go to perform in Africa. Yeah, okay. So you know, so as a Rasta man, it's very sentimental. I go to Africa, you know? But not for the perform. Yeah. performance. Yeah, but you know. It's a good man. Yeah, man, go Africa. Well. You know, I go Japan, I go China, I go most of the Caribbean islands, I go most places in the state. You know, I go Europe, almost all the European countries. I've been there. Mm. 
you know. I'm going to some new festival when I never, when I go up and uh, I a lot of festival. People don't know, so sometimes when they never used to see me locally. The road, eh? I'm the road, I work hard. And I, <laughs> I work some, hard. And sometimes I know all about this sometimes, you know, because sometimes you have to go and make a name. Mm, you understand? True. You just cover expenses. Sometimes, sometimes we have to do that, you know. Just like forget to teach them there, you right. have to make sacrifices. A lot. Yeah, so you know me I can talk about, right? So we do them things about Africa sentimental to me. But I mean, say, me is a people person. Anyway, people them there. Yeah, man. You're, you're Until the philosophy which all one race superior and inferior is finally and permanently discredited and abandoned yeah, and them no are. peace. So mm -hmm. me no prejudice skin or colour and them thing there. We go do jar works and just say we for that message. If a person come for a show, I want to talk to them and we say we don't answer, get too excited. I will not do it, I was too angry. Right, right. And from the vibe right. We know that at the most I will for God, so we do that and spread the message. Because we don't want to be like Jonah and get swallowed in a wheel belly. <laughs> Not literally a wheel, but you know what I mean. We do yeah, the the like, world, you know what I mean? Right. Yes, and I, I know you have mentioned Lady Leslie and a few times. How, how many children? We have three children three together, children. three beautiful children. Congratulations, yeah, man. man. I think I'll be fruitful and multiply yeah, the good man. books. Yeah, you know, man. Bless my blessing, that man. Bless you know, yeah, that no, man. that's why I've seen certain times. I've seen what virtuous woman, they provide me the one. Yes. You know? Empress or the yeah, vibe, Empress man. Or, yeah, yeah, man. So, <laughs> yeah, that's why I try to sing some yeah. songs like that, you know? Outside of music, though, if I remember music I yeah, use, put food on the family table, what is that one thing a warrior king love enough outside of music when we then feed him family? I love farming. Farming. Yeah, I love farming, I love agriculture. And I love like, I love um, engineering, I love, you know? Oh, you with love the, the metal work okay. and everything like that. Oh, okay, the engineering yeah. thing there. Yeah, because I do it at school, you know, yeah, so yeah, I have yeah. an idea, you know? But, Farming, I'm a thing. I see my father do it, and not for my family, them from my mother's side. Uncle Sherman, the whole work, St. Mary, you know. So, farming is, is a thing, you know. Food is a medicine, make a be a food, a food be a medicine. Yes. And any nation that invests in agriculture can look towards the future with confidence. So. Amen, brother. Yeah, man, definitely. Warrior, still madly in love with the music. Never, like, woman come like, music come like a woman, you know. Yeah. Jealous, <laughs> body, you know. Jealous, you know why some artists don't really make it, even when you see up talent, mm -hmm. some like make it from need to get the break? Because sometimes you invest in, you see music, it takes everything, you have to get all your attention. And your wife, if you have a woman, she have, if she don't know that, she, she might have to go though. stay yeah, and, and Yeah, you understand? Music is a jealous thing. Barry Salmon teach me them things. Yeah. Music is like old people, you can't rush it either. Because <laughs> see more you rush it, you get miserable for you. know. I and music is there. Like music is there before one. I and I, and music is there when I and I not to be there in a physical form. So, yeah, so yeah, rush it. Yeah, but you're, you're jealous. So when I do music, you have to fully, you have to get your full hundred. Good and bad times, you have to stick to her. Because she stick to you, and when she rise, she will rise with you. Yes, brother. Bro, go on to the thing, I know relatively, a whole heap of just left in our tank, musically speaking. Yeah, man, of course. We are waiting for the anniversary light yes. and whatever is to come. We are looking forward to it on a song. Yes. Anniversary thing. And, and more collaborations that will be featured. Yeah, more collaborations. Yeah. And the Bounty Project, I look yeah, forward to that. Yeah, man, Jah will let it be done. Yeah, we are put out to the universe. To yeah. You see, the first time we record with Little Blocks, yeah. we record this song. We record it. Take me advice. All right. I have a song with me and him sing, but we now nah, forget to we are cup. We got the whole of Waterford, we got yeah, the whole right. of Portmore, we got the whole of Sanganity, we got the whole of St. Elizabeth, you know, we got the whole of Linstead, we got the whole of Kingston, Jamaica, the whole all parishes, and we got the whole world. Thank you for support, Warrior King. You know, go and tune in to teach him because this platform is very educational. And I hope this little vibration all you get you get some farmer inspiration, you know? Yeah, definitely. So more strength. Rastafari I live and we don't conquer everything. We love Girl, them ever wear them. Yeah, man. Record this song. But it's good when you keep one. <laughs> yeah. No, really, no, big man thing. Be we here, love, we love no man. Be no, here, I tell man. you. That's right. a one. No, look, I'm, you can't, I don't know. All right, watch her, watch her. Some man keep more than one, you know. Right. In Africa, it's a, it's a, it's a culture, but yeah. all them do it, it's a different type of way. Because I go to Gambia and see man have four or five wives. But all of them know each other, mm. and all of them are treated kind of equally. But still, when I go to Gambia, I see it. We still say woman uncomfortable in the situation. Mm -hmm. Even though a part of the culture with them unhappy, because they still have a thing called jealousy. Because they feel like the one they get a little better More treatment. Attention. So you see true Mr. Rastafari, you see the way of Ali Selassie the first. We know him up Empress for Zero Men in a film queen that so if me I tried Rastafari, me feel like say yeah, my, I'm father, the light of yeah, my father. Yeah, biblically yeah. and a certain way. We're not married man, but me live in man. You know no, no, wrong with that man. <laughs> Take a woman and call her wife. You know? Yeah, man. Yeah, but eventually you know, she gonna be that man. Yeah, man, yeah. she yeah. a wife. No, no, for your, your wife, man. A wife. Are your wife? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. We are going to live in man. Whenever your girlfriend and certain mention in the right. literature, mm. whether the scripture or the literature, a wife. Are your wife. Whether you do it legally by the system or not, but are your wife. Yeah, you know, sometimes we see virgin and 
I said, my girlfriend, it sounds like if you're a big man, I said, girlfriend. <laughs> you know, to me, I don't know if I true, I get more, so more mature. Yeah, we understand where you are, know? man. Your wife. Why? Yeah, but until yeah. you want to get the official yes. thing on your name, that's between you and her and Jack. See, I put up one finger about what, man? Yeah, man, that's what I'm saying. So, you're a wife for me and a husband for you. Yeah, man, Rastafari, right? so, it's Alice Lassie. Last yeah, yeah, man. And if you check most of the successful people, True, as we said that well, before, yeah, man, man. You, you need, you need that, yeah, that balance then, I think. Yeah, man, let me say, I listen to the Empress Men in Balance, and that, and the example, that are the light, when me see shine bright, and there's the light me I shine. So, Powers. Powerful, Rastafari. Powerful, yeah. We love to see the girls them everywhere we go. We love to see them everywhere we go. Everywhere we go, Yeah, right. man, but Jab bless me one, and we give thanks. <laughs> We're good. Give thanks, know, brother, we sing, brother. We now stop singing songs for the yeah, ladies. I appreciate the reason, brother, yeah, brother. Man. You understand? And, and the work that the man has put in. See, quality body of work. No fuss, no rush, no controversy, no loudness, no yeah. coolness, no rudeness. Positive, uplifting and motivating, man. Yeah, and with the wow, social... With the social... We appreciate the work, brother. Yeah, man, brother, thank because you, Because we have enough of uh, that side of the thing there. We still need but the still conscious... But it's a balance still. It's a balance. balance thing. We still it's need the conscious warriors them fit. You know what I mean? Yeah. Not only keep the thing going, but also bring through some next young conscious warriors in the thing. Yes. So, I think, like, one of the so you love the working music? Well, love the consciousness, brother, the positivity, the uplifting right. nature of the yes. music. As I say, we have enough over here so already. We always need balance. A balance with the no, world, right? No, we're not closing the program, yeah, but I'll yeah. tell you something. You know how much people call me phone and say, We're not going to teach them. Everything. I say, Everybody. Time, All my friends and my girlfriend, you're not going to teach them. Yeah, man. Bless the love, man. Big up the ISS, general, big up yourself, big up Leslie and the yeah, Roots Warrior family. You know, big up everyone. I say, WarriorKingMusic.com. You want to contact me for sure. Any farmer business or any, you just want to know what's going on. On Warrior King Music.com, all the social media handles, everything. Thank you very much. And Rastafari Live. And look for great things. Anniversary light is on the way. And keep your love light shining as bright as ever. Bless the love. This is Warrior King. Teach him. Thank you very much. Right, Bless the love. Yeah, man. Give thanks. Blessings, man. Yeah, that's a wrap.